policing, like I said, it's not just a practice, meaning that like when we encounter the police, yeah, they're arresting us, you know, but it's also a, a, an ideology. It's how people think, right? And the idea of believing in punishment, that there are bad people and good people, and then who needs to be punished, which is really a question of who's not seen as a member of the public which historically has been Black people, Indigenous people, drug users, people with disabilities, people with mental health problems, sex workers, queer and trans people. Um, you know, all of these groups are seen as outside the public, immigrants, whoever, right? And that's what makes us the people who need to be policed, the people who are outside the thin blue line, the people that that thin blue line is holding back, right? That line between chaos, we are the chaos. So. Um, unless you shift how people think about that and ask people to really think about, like, why do you call police when someone's asking for change outside Tim Hortons? You know, like, why do you think the police are appropriate mechanism when somebody's living in a tent? 